Very final story. NANS NANS threatens protest over lingering NOU and that's National University Law Student Crisis. The National Association of Nigerian Students has issued a notice of mass actions over the protracted crisis between the Council of Legal Education and the National Open University of Nigeria. It said the crisis had in hindered the law graduates of the university from being admitted to the Nigerian Law School for over five years. A statement by the National Vice President External Affairs of the Association, Mr. Taiwo Bamibade, and made available to newsmen in Abuja on Tuesday said the protests will begin on 27th of August and will be made in two phases. He said that the association had earlier written a letter to notify President Muhammad Buhari on Monday over the crisis. The NANS recalls that the student body had issued a three-month ultimatum to the federal government on May 23rd to admit the law graduates from now into the Nigerian law school. Now, I remember when I was in university as well, there were certain schools that you know that these ones can't go to law school. National Open University was one of them. And I used to think, if you understand that this, you can't go to law school from here, then why are you studying law there anyway? That was like the first question that popped up in my head. Now, it's traumatic for someone to go through university, study in Nigeria for five years, you study to, to become a lawyer, and then you come out and you can't even practice your law anyway because you can't go to the Nigerian law school. You know what gets me? The fact that often at times they make it seem as though education is a privilege. When education is not a privilege, it is literally a human right that every human being is entitled to. Yes, we can argue that further education is a choice, but fact of the matter is, if somebody goes to university for five years to study law and then wants to make it to law school, how are we looking at a situation where they are not even allowed to achieve and follow their dreams? That says that the environment is not conducive, and that screams a very big problem. Now, it is, we'd like to see how the story plays out, but I can't say that I empathize with all the students, all the law graduates from the National Open University, understanding myself, what it took me to go through university, study law for five years, and then coming out and then being told you can't go to law school is such a shame. I would like to see how the story progresses, and definitely, we'll be bringing you updates from that here on Hello Nigeria. But thank you very much for joining us on today's Trending Stories. To enjoy more of this, our will get videos when you just watch. Press this button to subscribe on top of our YouTube page. You go love her.